Good day, home buyers and residents. Today, we're in BF Homes, Holy Spirit, Quezon City, and we will explore this brand new duplex house for sale right behind me. And each unit features a total of four bedrooms, four bathrooms, with 320 square meters of interior space, built on a 192 square meter lot. And each unit has an asking price of 27 million pesos. As always, for the details and information about this property, we will leave in the description box below. My name is Paul Bueno, your trusted licensed real estate broker. Stick with us, don't forget to subscribe, and let's start the tour. This property is facing southwest and your frontage has a width of more or less 8 meters. As you can see sa inyong facade, maliwala siya, meron tayong wood accent design, and here is your balcony na later pupuntahan natin. And here you have your black steel gate with sherwood plank board. Yan yung sherwood plank board, it is flexible, durable, and water resistant. So it is good for outdoors. Oh, by the way, you have mailbox here. Okay, let's go inside. So we're now inside of your property. We are now in your two vehicle carport. As you can see, it's It can fit two full-size SUVs or even two vans. Sa inyong flooring, you have concrete paver tiles. Ayan o, non-slip siya. Kaya kapag wala yung inyong cars, you can utilize or maximize the space. Above, you have pinless around, and you have polycarbonate roofing. So, ang kagandaan niya sa polycarbonate, the light passes through. So, kahit nandito kayo sa inyong carport, tumatambay, di ba? Maliwanag siya or maliwalas. Okay, so now let's go to your side yard. Dito sa inyong side yard, you have 1.8 meter setback. So, yan, no? maluwag siya. Here sa side na to, you can put your plants. Ayan, di ba? Pwede, pwede yan. On this side is your main door. So, later natin yan papasokin. So, let's go. Here is your pathway or your walkway. Ayan. Dito sa area na to, pwede nyong lagyan ng plants or pwede nyong i-landscape. Ayan, meron tayong faucet or watering the plants and outdoor lighting. Ayan, pag gabi, di ba? Maliwanag siya. And here, it's your lanai. You can place your chairs and table para dito, no? Sa umaga. You can zip a cup of coffee. Yan dito, presko siya, di ba? Sa umaga. Matama yan. On this side, dito yung inyong access going to dining area. And later, papasokin natin yan. And by the way, as you can see, meron tayong trench drain. Ayan. Hindi siya yung typical na drainage na meron doon sa front. Meron sa corner, do sa likod. So, why yung design niyan is trench drain? Because your roofing has no roof gutter or walang alulod. So, kapag umulan yan, dire-diretso yan, nakislope, papatakin yan, pababa, meron siyang waterfall effect. Ah, ang ganda niya, di ba? <laughs> okay, let's go here. Ito yung door that, that leads you to your kitchen. Later, papasukin din natin yan. And by the way, yung roofing nyo, merong... Polycarbonate, dito sa side yard. Ayan, no? kita-kita nyo. Hindi siya madilim. And here is your pocket garden. So, pwede kayo maglagay ng plants or you can landscape it. Let's go now to your service or utility area. So, this door leads you to your shared toilet and bath. Okay. So, on this side, you have utility sink. So, ang gandahan dito sa area na to, meron siyang opening for air ventilation. And this door leads you to your household staff room. Yun. It has a decent size. So, malubag siya. Okay na okay.
Ang kaganda dito sa inyong side yard, maluwag siya, saka maliwalas. So we're now at the entrance of your lovely home. Uh, maybe you're wondering bakit nandito sa side ang inyong main door. Because yung architect, i-consider niyo yung feng shui design. So this door is made of solid mahogany. So let's go inside and you reside. Okay, so we're now in your foyer. So dito sa inyong foyer, you can place a sofa, a table, a display, or any furniture para magkaroon ng karakter dito sa inyong foyer. On this wall, you can put a display or a painting. Okay, so let's go now to this door that leads you to your toilet and bath. Ayan. Ang ganda ang inyong toilet and bath dito. Here is your lavatory, your water closet, and here is your enclosed shower area. All right. Parang nasarap maligo do sa shower area, no? <laughs> so now, let's go to this door that leads you to your bedroom number one. This bedroom number one has an approximate size of 17 square meters. So this bedroom, you can also convert it into a den, office, or a library. Yan, tamang tama yan. So here you have two windows. You have awning window here. You have sliding windows here. So it has a nice ventilation. Above, you have pin lights around. Okay, so now let's go to this barn door that leads you to your shared toilet and bath. But why it is called shared? Because earlier, pinuntahan natin tong toilet and bath na to, gamit yung access dun sa foyer. So meron din siya access dito sa bedroom number one. Okay, so we're now in your living area. So ipapakita namin yung space. So you will have an idea paano i-arrange or i-design ang inyong furniture. On this side, you have a huge glass window for ventilation and natural lighting. So pag binukas nyo yan, yun. Mahangin siya, saka presko. Oh, let's go here to your dining area. Oh, very spacious, no? So above, you have drop ceiling with cove lighting with pin lights around. And here, meron tayong provision for drop lights or a beautiful chandelier para sa inyong 6 to 8 seater dining table. Yeah, para masarap kumain. Di ba? So sa flooring, meron tayong 60 by 60 Malaysian porcelain tiles. Yeah. And on this side, yan, ito maganda dito eh. Meron tayong glass sliding door Yan, to access your side yard. At pag binuksan nyo yan, mahangi siya, presko, tama-tama habang kumakain sa dining area. Okay, so now let's go to your kitchen. So let's start here sa inyong kitchen cabinets. Yan, meron siyang laminated wood grain design. Yan, nandiyan ang electrical panels. More storage. Yan, more shelves. Yan, ito naman ang provision for your double door. Refrigerator. Ayan, tama tama yun, ba? And here is your pantry organizer. Yun. As you can see, nandito yung inyong stainless pull-out basket tray. So here, pwede nyo ilagay yung kitchen wares, food, or any stuff. Ayan. Okay. So let's go here. Sa inyong kitchen, merong black granite countertop with SUS 304 st stainless steel kitchen sink. Ayan. <laughs> well, dito, sa baba naman, sa base cabinet, more storage, meron tayong drawers. Ayan. Dami pang storage. And above naman, sa inyong overhead cabinets, meron white colored kitchen cabinet. Nagko-contrast siya, di ba? Dun sa black countertop. And here, sure, Cooktop, your Elba cooktop, which is made in Italy. We have three burners and electric hot plate. Above, you have your Elba range hood. So what I love about this kitchen is the island counter. So this island counter has a black granite countertop with 
waterfall edge design. Ayan, di ba? Malaki siya. Pwede pa siyang gawing breakfast nook. Lalagyan lang ng stools dyan sa harapan. Above, you have beautiful drop lights. Ayan, tama-tama yan habang nag-prepare ng food. Kitang-kita yan, maliwanag siya. And underneath, marami pa tayong storage. Ayan, no? Ayan pang shelf. And more drawers. And on this side, is your liquor storage. Ayan, no? You can taste here your wine, whiskey, and your other bottle liquors. I love this open concept layout. Very spacious. So we're done with the ground floor. Let's go now upstairs. But before that, can I request to boop the like button to help the YouTube algorithm show this video to more real estate lovers like you. Okay? All right. So here, sa inyong staircase, you have a width of one meter. Meron tayong solid mahogany plank steps, solid mahogany handrail, and steel railings. Okay, let's go. Ito sa inyong stairs, meron tayong pendant light and staircase lighting. Let's go. Okay, so we're now on the second floor of your lovely home. Let's go to this door that leads you to your master bedroom. This master bedroom has an approximate size of 20 square meters. Above, you have pin lights around with cathedral-like design ceiling. Ayan o, naka-slope siya. Ganda niya. Sa flooring, you have hanwa vinyl wood planks. On this side, ayan, maraming puno yung kapitbahay niyo. Meron kayong glass window here. Pag binuksan niyo yan, yun, mahangin siya. Saka, presko. Okay, so, we'll show you the space of the master bedroom. Ayan, para magkaroon kayo ng idea how to arrange your bed or your other furniture. Let's go here. So, this is your master walk-in closet. Ayan, marami tayong shelves, closet here, your wardrobe, his and hers, or sa mag-partner. Diba? Ayan. Ayan, ang meron dyan. And meron pa tayong oops huge mirror yan sa inyong walk-in closet yan sa lang maraming pang shelves oh di ba may pa storage para sa inyong damit <laughs> so this door leads you to your master toilet and bath ayan so, ang ganda ng toilet and bath niyo you have his and hers uh, bathroom sink yan, with black countertop Ayan. You have huge vanity mirror and base bathroom cabinets. Ayan. More storage, you know, open shelves para sa towels. And here's your water closet. Sa ngayon tiles niya, no? maganda yung color combination. May beige and light gray sa flooring. And here, sure, shower area. Let's go now to your balcony. You have glass lighting door to access your balcony. Ayun. Okay na okay dito. Mahangin. Presko. Alright. So, we are now in your family area. So, here, you can utilize this space, di ba? You can bond with your family. And dito yung provision for electrical outlet, internet. You can place here your wall-mounted TV for watching Netflix or movies, di ba? And of course, kung may TV dyan, pwedeng ilagay dito ang couch or your sofa. Okay, so now let's go to your second floor balcony. Ayan. Maraming puno yung kapitbahay. So dito, mahangin siya sa kapresto. So we have two remaining bedrooms. Right here. Ayan, maliwanag dito sa hallway nyo, ano? You have pin lights. So, let's go now to your bedroom number two. This bedroom number two has an approximate size of 14 square meters. So, you have pin lights around. Your flooring is Hanwa vinyl wood planks. And here is your 
huge glass window. And dito meron tayong floor to ceiling height built-in wardrobe or cabinet with wood grain design. Ayan. And this door leads you to your ensuite toilet and bath. Okay, so now let's go to your bedroom number three. This bedroom number three has an approximate size of 14 square meters. Above, you have pin lights around. So in your flooring, you have Hanwa vinyl wood planks. So this is a corner bedroom. Meron tayong corner windows. Pag binuksan nyo yung parehas, meron siyang cross ventilation. So mahangin yan, saka presko. So on this side naman, nandito ang inyong floor to ceiling height built-in cabinet or wardrobe with wood grain design. Oh, ayan no? Malaki siya. Okay. So, let's go to this uh, door that leads you to your ensuite toilet and bath. We're done with all the bedrooms here on the second floor. So, now, let's go to your attic. By the way, nandito yung inyong drop lights or pendant lights. Yeah, just sa inyong stairs. Yeah, just sa attic nyo. You know, spacious siya. You can use this as a family room. Pwede rin sa mga bata, pwede rin gawing gaming room. You can place your PC, console, Xbox, PlayStation. Or pwede rin gawing storage, di ba? Pwede pwede yan. So let's go now to your attic balcony. Ayan. Di ba? Presko dito. Sa mahangin. If you are interested in this real property, our contact details are on the screen right now and we will assist you in showing and acquiring this beautiful property. And if you want to see more exciting real estate episodes in the future, please subscribe and hit the bell button to get notified. So you may like, share, and comment your thoughts. Once again, this is Paul Bueno. Thank you and have a nice day.